So not that long ago, I went through my whole van and decluttered, got rid of all of the things that I guess you could deem or that I would have deemed or had deemed <laughs> unnecessary because I, I won't go as far as to say I got rid of everything that I don't need because I definitely kept certain things that aren't like essential for my living, but they are things that made me really happy. So I still kept them. So at the end of all of that, I was super stoked and really content with all of the items that I did have. Hmm. But then my mom called me and she said that she still had a few things of mine that I guess way back when, this had to be like six years at least now, that before I moved to California, I had asked her to hold on to some things. I don't remember that. But she said that I still have a few things at her house that because she's in the process of moving, she found them, otherwise she wouldn't have even known they were there. So I still have to go handle that mess. But before we do that, I also went through a double take of the area in my life where I have the most stuff. And that's kind of like planners and papers, stuff like that, yeah. And luckily for me, Poshmark actually just opened up a home section on the app. So now you can sell like home goods, bedding, stationary ah yes so perfect timing because i just combined a bunch of my planners into one so i've got some planner stuff to sell and if you don't know what poshmark is it is just an app where you can sell your gently used clothing and now home goods as well you can just go on the app and search hobo alley if you're interested in any of the items that i'm going to be listing for sale and i'm not i don't know if i'm going to show all of them in this video so definitely go check that out but i'll do my best to kind of get a comprehensive overview of what is the type of stuff that I'm gonna put on this go around and then also if you're interested in starting your own closet or boutique on the Poshmark app there is a link in the description and in the pinned comments that will take you there okay so let's start with the planner things or the stationery um, first up I have an a5 hole punch I got this from Michaels and I really used it like twice. So definitely don't really need this. This will be for sale. And then there's also this, which is brand new. It is a Wordsworth planner, still in the plastic. So this is the Wordsworth planner and this is the one that I used. It's clearly not the one in the packaging, but just so you get kind of a general view of what it's like. Um, it starts every month. It's got where you can put your goals. And then it has where you write in the month and then you have like a reflection section and then you can also review it. And then back here, it also has a section to do your weeks. So that is one week. And then the third part of this planner is back here where it just has some dot grid and it's got plenty of that in case you want to take notes. And then in the very, very back, it does have this pocket, has a pen loop and then just close it like that. And then, the cream of the crop, I've got my A5 Filofax. This, oh, is so hard for me to let go, but I really don't use it. Like, to the point where the cardboard, to keep this, like, structurally chilling, is still in there. Because I experimented with it, but look, all the original papers, original dividers, even the little plastic thing. So that is going to be listed, but with this one, I actually also have the original box and then I've got all of the other like papers that it came with. So I can put these back in the actual Filofax, put it in the box and ship it off to you if anyone is interested in an A5 size Filofax. So that is the stationary category. And now the hard part. Now it's time to go to my mom's house and deal with whatever I've got over there. Who are you? Her name's Brimley. Brimley? Mm -hmm. Oh! I can't. I think you have to go find it. Hold on. Pee on me if you have to. <laughs> oh, she's so sweet. Hi, hey, sweet girl. Oh, oh big yawn. So, my mom got a dog today, apparently. Here's a nap. <gasps> Look at that big puppy. Look at her. Okay, so as soon as I got to my mom's house, we actually ended up going through her clothes first, sorting through some things that she no longer wants. This is a six? Six? Yeah. That's not gonna fit me. I love it, but it's not gonna fit me. Look, this has the tags on it. It's 
and she never wore it. And she actually has a good number of specifically Harley Davidson shirts that she no longer wants. So I'm gonna put those on Poshmark as well. There are some, these are just four of them, but there's some of them that even still have the tags. Brimley, I don't know if I introduced her. This is Brimley. <laughs> you can put your foot in there. Or none. <laughs> Here, she's stuck on the wall. <laughs> Bring your leg over. <laughs> All right, let's go look at the stuff I actually came here to look at, though. That is the target. That's what we're going for. There's a bunch of bedding in there. Yep. There's the stuff, and you can see. Treasures. Okay, so are you so, going to get rid of this? Yes. Justin doesn't use them. Okay, well, there's that because it's brand new, and no one's using open. that. Here is a better look at that sheet set. It is a twin. That is what it looks like in the picture. These are brand new never opened so those will be on poshmark for sure blanket this comforter yeah that's mine why do you even have that like i, I, I literally don't... thought i got rid of all my stuff why do you even because when you live in the know. duplex with us you just tossed everything wherever and mom was just like i'll put all these sheets and comforters in here and then i took off to california and never grabbed my stuff yes like... i guess I don't know. <laughs> okay that's exactly what happened yeah. this is a twin sheet set i think we no longer have twins yeah we got rid of those kids oh, sorry. <laughs> 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 i just realized what you said <laughs> this is hard for me i didn't anticipate it being important things look oh i still have mine do you that makes me not want to get rid of mine okay so i guess really i didn't have that much this bedding. is childhood no, right I here have... that ain't ever going away yeah. Four blankets? I have four blankets that oh, I have look, to decide we can get rid what to of do this with. One. These are your curtains. You don't need these, do you? you she wants the some curtains. Now? Yeah. These are the curtains. I mean, it doesn't look like a curtain. They're well, because it's not unrolled. Well, I know, but it still doesn't look like I a curtain. I think to me. they were honestly bathroom curtains. Oh, oh actually, like a shower? Yeah. Yeah. Shower. yeah. Shower. Those are my shower, shower curtains. Curtain. Yes. Okay. And this is that shower curtain that my sister was talking about the red and black with characters on it. And then Scooby. Yeah, this is Scooby. Just Scooby right? Yeah, that's just Scooby. Where are you? It's got a little, but. And then the Rugrats. What size is this? This is a twin. Okay. There's Chucky. Hey. And it comes with a puppy. It yeah. comes with a puppy. It comes with a picture of a puppy. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I should do. I should just take a picture of Grimley and put it in all the packages. I don't know if I can get rid of this one, though. This is one of those. It might spark joy. Can't get rid of these two because these are too sentimental. And my sisters are both keeping their version of these. So this is how this happens i'm just gonna stuff this back in the cedar chest because they won't fit in the van and then i'm gonna wonder in a couple of years how my mom still has some of my stuff but that's okay it's fine so these are worth keeping don't tell mom <laughs> out of all my blankets this is the one i gave away i had four i gave away one I kept two that are super sentimental. And then this is the one that I'm going to be putting on my Poshmark closet. Um, it is a full slash queen size, but I, I just didn't unfold it all the way. And it's kind of got like these uh, velvety stripes. <laughs> nice description, right? Um, it is black and then it is a Daisy Fuentes comforter. <laughs> All right, well, that's it for my mom's house. Oh, yep, okay. Unless you wanna go. I feel rude if I move. Oh, you moved, okay. That's my out. <gasps> and now you're stuck. Yeah. <laughs> you're stuck. <laughs> no. Yes. It is a rule if a dog falls asleep on you, do not move. Grimly, I have to go. I don't know, I'm. All right. <laughs> so those are just some of the new items that are going to be listed in my Poshmark closet. Again, you can find me on the app by searching Hobo Alley. And if you are interested in starting your own closet, there's that link in the description in the pinned comments just for you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.